Hello. I wanted to talk to you today about transdermal magnesium and fluoride. Um, fluoride is present not only in all of our hygiene, a lot of hygiene products such as toothpaste and mouthwashes, etc. We also find it um, in the water supply. Um, and this fluoride is dangerous to the body, um, especially, I mean, some natural forms of fluoride that you find naturally present in water systems, uh, you know, natural spring waters even. Um, this is not dangerous, um, but it's when we add <laughs> fluoride to anything or we, you know, change the dosage or, you know, because when it's found naturally, it's at a very, very, very small level comp compared to everything else in the water. And, you know, this is a total... Um, changing of the natural order of things and so um, the fluoride gets in the body as well as the chlorine in the water systems now it's you they use chloramine now in certain areas because it they say it cleans the pipes or whatever but um, really it's just a much more volatile and rapid form of absorption um, so it's not even chlorine it's more chloramine now in a lot of the water systems and so we've got this intense um, uh, effect on the body, not only on the gut and the microflora and all of um, anywhere the bacteria are in the body are affected by this chlorine and fluoride combination. But one of the worst features of fluoride is what it does to the brain and um, the effects on the brain and the effects on intelligence even uh, coming through um, because basically because fluoride isn't meant to be at these levels in the brain and um, so not only fluoride, we also have radioactive iodine, we have heavy metals, we have a lot of other things which are all competing toxins, I guess you could say, and uh, all of which can be addressed by magnesium to a certain degree. Magnesium can chelate, especially a, a molecularly pure magnesium, can chelate a lot of these toxins and heavy metals and pull them out through the bloodstream to the amongtaries, through the bile system, um, through the hair, through the transpiration through through many different areas but um and so learning to use this transdermal application on the head for example or anywhere else but on the head has been very valuable to me um i feel like um it has been contributing to a release of aluminum macro aluminum in the body and other um you know, keeping out. I mean, that's the real thing is when you have the right minerals in the body that are and healthy, they fill in the gaps that a lot of these unhealthy um, halogens, isotopes, and 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 um, and unhealthy, you know, heavy metals um, will fill in if uh, the holes are left there. It's just like anything bad in the world is usually created because we we create a space for it, and uh, so it's the same thing in the body. And uh, trying to overcome our deficiencies is the first uh, level of understanding. If we can overcome, you know, vitamin D and magnesium deficiency, which a lot of people have not still overcome yet, uh, they, there's more consciousness around it. But we still there's still some pieces missing to the puzzle, and so we're trying to bring that piece here with the transdermal magnesium of a high purity, coming originally from the Zechstein source in Holland from Vendam, most. Producers will not tell you where they get their source from, what the city is, etc. They'll just say the word Zechstein or Permian and hide behind that because you can. There's no legal protection for that word. It's a geological era. So we're trying to help people know through our logo, through the Zechstein inside logo and the actual original source of the only source in the world for this product, which is in Vendam in Holland. So we always use glass bottles. We help people to understand that. Using this can help bring the fluoride out of the brain and the macroaluminum out of the brain, um, or the microaluminum in this case, nano or whatever particles, um, and help detoxify the system. So come check it out. It's only 12 bucks a month. It's not expensive. You just have to know about it. Uh, come see us at theheartoftradition.com. Thanks.